Hi guys, watched a video by Roshan.org on making a pinhole camera and I thought I might have a go at that. So I'm going to use a fast food outlets drink carton, uh, scissors, a marker pen, rubber band, barbecue skewer, I just need it for something pointy, some thin paper, white paper, some self-adhesive sticky back plastic or decorative vinyl as it calls this, and some baby oil. The idea is I'm just going to make a hole in the end of this that the light will go in and the paper will go at the other end to make the screen for us to look at. The baby oil should make the paper go fairly translucent so you can actually see the image from the outside. I'll try it first of all without putting the oil on it and then I'll try it with the oil, see what the difference is. And the sticky back plastic is just to make this a bit darker because you want as little light getting in from the outside as possible. You just want the light to come in the hole at the end. So I'll colour the end in black to reduce the light. And I'll cover the sides in plastic. Now we need to put the paper over the end. want it to be as flat as possible. And we need to make a hole in there. Now we need something bright to point it at and see if we get a picture. Right, I've tried it with the sun and can't really see anything so we'll try it with the baby oil on it. Right, I can see the effect but it's going to be difficult to show you on the camera so what I'm going to do now just put a tube round the outside so that we can look inside without the external light making it difficult to see.
but we've now got a viewing tube on it. So I'll have to pick up the camera and see if we can see. Now, what we're looking at there is upside down looking out of my window. So that's the house opposite. The lines on my window. If I just take that out of the way, let the camera catch up again. So that's what we're looking at. Put that over there. Now you can see the house opposite. If I turn the camera upside down, what can we see? Yes, yeah, so we're looking out of my window. See the diamond window and the house outside. So that's a pinhole camera working. If I made the viewing tube a bit darker that would be even better. Remember I'm holding the camera upside down now. So I'm having trouble working out what I'm doing. Take the tube off again. Let the camera come right. So, there we go, a pinhole camera. Thank you Roshan.org for the idea. I think I might try and do an improved one. I've got a bucket there. So I'll do another episode and see if we can use the bucket.